Bonjour, bonjour, I'm Angel from FrenchLaw.org and today I am going to let you know how it is possible to speak from day one and give you three ways that you can do it. Speak from day one has become some kind of go-to catchphrase and even I use it when I speak about my coaching method. However, for many students, this phrase is pretty puzzling, if not downright scary. How the heck do you speak without any knowledge of the language? If that sounds familiar to you, keep watching. But first things first. Assuming that it is possible at all, should you try to speak from day one? You need to start with the end in mind. If you are learning a language to be able to read documents, you might get away without ever speaking at all. But if you are learning a language in order to speak it, you will have to speak at some point. There is no way around it. And while I'm giving the uncomfortable facts, here is another one. You will never be ready. If you start studying regardless of the method, and you delay the speaking part until you are ready, if you're waiting for some kind of magical moment when you will finally feel ready to start speaking, this moment will probably just never happen. You need to start where you are right now. Now, does that mean that without knowing hardly any French, you should book a plane ticket and try to chat up the first natives that you come across in Paris? Absolutely not. That would be the recipe for a very awkward moment. So what do you do? If your current level will not allow you to have complex interactions, you cannot change this fast. The only thing that you can change fast is the interaction itself. If you can't have complex interactions, you need to arrange some simple ones to match your simple skills. Here are three ways that you can have some simple interactions from the most adventurous to the safest. So option one, the adventurous way. If you feel quite adventurous, but not so keen on spending a lot on a plane ticket, you can do a short version of the trip abroad. Here is what you need. One, a shop or restaurant where native speakers work. Try to find one close to your place. This will be more or less easy depending on which language you're studying and where you live. And two, you need enough language skills to buy something there or to have a meal there. And you can learn those skills in a few hours beforehand. With this method, you can always use English as a fallback if this attempt at speaking your new language fails. Here are some downsides of this method. So the people you will be speaking to have generally no teaching skills and often they're not used to speaking to non-natives. So they might speak fast or use a language which is too complex for you to understand or even get impatient and switch back to English. Option number two is the language exchange. The idea behind a language exchange is simple. You connect with a native speaker of the language that you are learning who is also learning your language. And then you teach your languages to each other. You teach them English and they teach you French, Chinese, Russian, whichever language you're learning. Thanks to the internet, language exchanges nowadays can take all shapes of form. It might be anything from an hour-long real-life encounter to a brief text exchange with someone living across the world. There are many online services such as italki or HelloTalk who offer you to connect you with native speakers from across the world. I will put some links in the description below for you. In comparison to the previous method, the language exchange has a number of advantages. First, the person that you speak to is here to learn and they are likely to be more patient because they understand the struggles of learning a new language. They can correct you and teach you new things. Also, the potential of your conversations is not limited to one simple interaction. If you find a good partner, you can have regular conversations about many different topics, and it's free. The main downside is that finding a good language partner is not easy. I have found some great partners in the past, but I still get the impression that there's always a little bit of luck involved, or even a lot of luck involved. You might spend a lot of time looking for a good fit, 
and have little progress during this time. Which brings me to option number three, language coaching. If you have no time to waste, but you do have some money to invest, then language coaching is definitely the best option for you. There are many advantages. First off, the coach's job is to help you learn the language as fast as it gets. He can answer your questions very accurately and save you hours of Googling. A good coach is very mindful of the student needs. He is patient and motivating. He understands the needs and limits of the students, yet he is somehow able to drag the student out of his or her comfort zone and get him or her to speak. Like, I don't really care if it's day one or day 42, but you are not leaving a session with me without having spoken at least a little bit. I know that you can speak and you will speak. Maybe you won't speak much at the beginning and that's okay. With every session, you will speak a little bit more and your confidence will grow every time. Knowing that you are able to speak will bring better results than any bit of the language that you might learn. And the feeling you get after having spoken is priceless. The downside is that it is not cheap. A good coach can cost you 50 to 60 euros per hour, which in US dollars is like 55 to 70 US dollars. Um, and you will need to take several sessions because there is very little point in having just one coaching session. Uh, what matters the most is really consistency. However, if you can afford it, you should definitely consider getting a coach. A good coach will literally shrink the way from where you are to where you want to be. In case you're interested in coaching session with me, you will find the link in the description below. I generally accept two new students every month, so just take a look. So that's it. Three ways that you can start speaking right now without endless preparation or far away traveling, even if it's day one. Any question, please ask in the comments. If you like this video, please hit the like button and subscribe for more. Thanks for watching, à très vite.